This week's Parsha is Parsha Vayishlach. And in the Parsha, Yaakov moves his whole family across the river. But after what probably took a really long time to move all the people, possessions, and animals across the river, he decides to stay on the other side of the river. This is really a key indicator of how you should treat your things. All his possessions were really important to him, and he moved them himself. But the commentators say that the reason that he stayed on that side of the river versus going over with his family is because he had to go back to their last encampment and pick up a few little small jars that he had forgotten there. Why were those small jars so important? So on the surface, it's probably just because all the things were important for him. But some of the commentators say that inside of these small jars was anointing oil that he had used to anoint the place where he slept when he had been fleeing his brother Esau the first time. For whatever reason that he went back to get these small jars, I think it's really, really important to note that all the possessions that we have are important. In the time of the Avot, I don't think it was possible to consume at the same rate in which we consume today. You know, overconsume. Today, most of us just have too much stuff, and we couldn't coordinate a move the way that Jacob coordinated his move so many years ago. But the thing that we can do is we can reduce the amount of things that we have, look at everything that we do have as a blessing, and pass on the things that are no longer serving us to someone who needs new blessing to come into their life. By letting go of the things that no longer serve us, we make space for new abundance and blessing to come to us. In fact, you can't receive new abundance and blessing if you don't have any space for it. So regardless of whether you're planning a move, making aliyah, or you just need to reclaim some of the space in your home, letting go of the things that don't serve you is gonna be key to making that happen. But doing it responsibly is really, really important. So recycle whenever you can, donate whenever you can, and save the trash as the last ditch resort. Remember, curating our best collection of stuff so we can live our best life and focus on the things that are important to us is super important. And if you need help, like and comment for more or reach out and comment.